rolling and action. <laughs> episode of Richie React. You already know why we're here. Demon Slayer Sunday. Well, it's probably Monday when you see this, but you get it. You get it. So we're on episode three. I low-key just had to watch my own reaction video just to get like a recap. The Mist Hashira was really, uh, just pretty much just talking down to the swordsman. Definitely understood what he was coming from, but just like Tanjiro had said, like, bro, learn how to talk to people. You know what I'm saying? It's always a way to put shit. Uh, the Miss Hashira was, you know, training with the, uh, with the mechanical doll, uh, called Yorichi Type Zero. Somebody came up with, like, a uh, interesting, like, thought. Imagine how dope of a swordsman you had to be that the doll that mimics your movements needs six arms just to keep up with what you do with two. Muchido, he had, uh, took a sword and an arm. Pretty much, Tanjiro was really helping, like, the swordsmith, like, just make sure that the doll was straight. The swordsmith was like, bro, you should just train too. Tanjiro gave that motherfucker the demon treatment, bro. Clean across the motherfucking neck. And then out pops the sword. I low-key forgot there was a sword inside of the doll. It's like, I kind of know, like, the end game. But, you know what I'm saying? As far as, like, the little details of how we got here, that's what's always intriguing me along with the animation. Uh, so, yeah. We're just going to jump right into it. Make sure you guys are liking and subscribing to the page. Also, uh, just a little fun game in the comment section that I want to start playing. Choose your two favorite emojis. And I want you to just throw them right there in the comments. And that's the end of the game. You won. As soon as you put it in there, it's like you you totally won. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and get started. Um, I got the green headphones today, but you know, see, we're moving on up because I know y'all just seen the splitter in the other episode. We also got, you know what I'm saying, some Bluetooth headphones. So that way I can, you know what I'm saying, sit back, relax, chill, and all that. <laughs> Shirt. Go watch that 90s baby special. Quit playing with me. <clears throat> Okay, to recap, mm. damn, it look crazy from a different angle. Oh my God. Whoa, bro, they are snapping with the animation. Can I light my blunt first? Well, the sword, maybe? If you don't have a sword, it makes sense. What the fuck? Oh, that's rust. I mean, that makes sense. How many times that dog done been in the rain? What the fuck was that? Who the fuck is this? Who the fuck is this nigga? That's Buddy? Don't you know what are you gonna do with a rusted sword, bro? Oh, fuck. We were just scared of this motherfucker like five seconds ago. For what? Training for what? Oh. He's pretty thoughtful. Damn. He's not a people person. Go figure. Take it easy, bro. Wow. And instantly applied that lesson. Ooh, what's that? Didn't he leave just as mysterious as he arrived? Oh, even polish the rest of okay. I get him, bro. I legit hate over shares, bro. He did that. He ain't lose shit. He took them shits out. Weird ass. You are on some hot shit. The fuck? Picking up teeth. Picking up teeth. I'm like, bro, I'm saying it and I don't even believe what I'm even saying. <laughs> they are adorable. Oh, shit. Oh my god. They took the panel and just up that shit. 
I'm really still trying to figure out who the fuck drew you up, bro. They need to go talk to the lady. I wonder how they did that. One thing about Demon Slayer, Ed, it's going to be lighthearted, but for about 3 minutes and 30 seconds. I'm really trying to figure out have I seen four consecutive minutes of happiness on this show. Everybody looking for that nigga. Shot right up. Nesco is the star of the show. This is her episode. I'm just now realizing. Oh man. He came in looking crazy. Mm. Oh shit now. Bro, we haven't seen a move until now. Now I'm sitting there thinking about it. Here we go. That shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Digivolve 2. Mmm. Kick the god damn. Good job. Nigga learning. None of these upper moons necks work like that. I don't even know why y'all keep going for the neck. Bro, is this a real life version of You've activated my trap card? Wait a minute. <sighs> Bro, you didn't got slept twice in a row. Do he know Gabby? Stop playing with me. Bro, new favorite character activated. Oh my gosh. Bro, why do you fight this one? God damn. I just like how the fact that, like, when Nezuko reaches a certain level after a while, she really can control it. Mm. Bro. I wish I talked to myself like this, bro. I'd be sitting there like, bro, he got us good. This shit's so clean. This nigga need a Shikamaru art. Tattoo! Yeah. Okay. Let him ribs crack, bro. I already know. He got here so motherfucking fast. Mmm. Damn, it's over already? I don't know why. It literally feels like we just started. So that was episode three of Demon Slayer. Yeah, they are moving right the fuck along. Where are we going to be a month from now? As fast as it's moving. I'm not trying to sound like a fucking douche when I say this. Knowing like the big things, it's like I knew they got separated, but I low-key forgot how. Bro, the way that it was illustrated and animated was crazy. I did not see that coming. I don't know what that move was that they just used on Tanja though, but I feel like me, me and him had the same face bro it was it bro it threw me the fuck off another thing like i said i was pointing out in the entertainment district whenever nezco was like at you know what i'm saying at that digivolution level and we just you know that's just a joke i'm using she had a hard time controlling it now it just seems like she's able to like go that far at will like it's, it's different levels and she went right up to like the champion level the one with the horn sticking out but it's just like is she doing some type of training is she doing some type of meditation while she's sleeping like how is she able to control it now when we only just one arc away we didn't see a lot of uh a shorty i'm pretty sure the animators was a little, was a little upset by that maybe that's probably why they went so hard these last couple episodes because they knew they was gonna have to skip a couple uh work days i'm really trying to make sure i didn't miss nothing the thing about the moons bro what moon has been able to just have their head removed clean like there is not a moon that can be killed with a neck swing shorty 
uh, from the from the entertainment district. The damn that won't her neck on the Moongan train. Like I mean, her neck was the train, but and I don't understand. Like as much as they've been fighting these upper moons, why has nobody ever made that like discernment, or have they just been like upgrading over time? Like, is there not like a system of protocol that we figure out? How the fuck do we get rid of this upper moon? You know what I'm saying? We know the next wings work for the lower demons. You know, even some of the stronger ones. These moons, bro, they are not being killed with the next wing. Oh, yeah. When Buddy got into that pot, I remember seeing the panel, but they found a way to make it as if I was just looking at that shit for the first time. Even when I knew it was coming, like I seen them out there, I was like, damn, who the fuck is this? I'm like, oh, shit. They finna run up on the pot. This is the first time we heard a move. Wow, bro, we haven't heard a move in like weeks. It was the first time we saw the move, the uh, the misbreathing. and that was dope. I'm really trying to make sure I don't forget that. Like this was, this was a dope episode. I don't really get to picking favorites when you're only three weeks in. Like, but this was like, yeah, it's getting more and more enjoyable. Last week was, you know, what I'm saying was enjoyable. The week before, I was, you know, what I'm saying just happy to be here. But this time it's like, bro, to get into the nitty gritty. You know, what I'm saying they boxing, they swinging. It's looking crazy. Yeah, I think we covered it, you guys. I think we looked into everything. So while you're here, make sure like, subscribe, play the game. You pick your two favorite emojis. Throw them in the comment section. Uh, but yeah, it's been another episode of Richie Reacts. <laughs>